presentations this evening. We're going to receive a presentation by the San Bernardino Park School District representative regarding Day of the Child celebration. And I believe Jennifer Blanco and Kevin Martinez are going to uh, do the presentation. Welcome. Thank you. Uh, Mayor Wayne, council members, city officials, and fellow San Bruno community members. Thank you for the opportunity to present an overview of last year's Dia de los Niños, Dia de los Libros, Day of the Child, Day of the Books celebration at San Bruno Park, and to preview this year's program on Saturday afternoon, May the 8th. The celebration brought together representatives of each of the schools in the San Bruno Park School District, okay. uh, preschools from around San Bruno, and at our school sites, uh, Barbara Brooksfort from the library, and our superintendent, Dr. David Hutt. And, it was, and there was a variety of performing artists of many cultures and free book giveaways uh, to all children. I'd like to take a step back and provide a little background on the DIA concept and take you a bit then through the day. In 1996, children's author Pat Mora linked the annual Mexican celebration of Dia de los Niños, Day of the Child, on April 30th with a focus on literacy. The first annual celebration occurred in Santa Fe in 1997, and the event was immediately embraced by the American Library Association. Celebration has grown to be known as Dia de los Niños, Dia de los Libros, or simply also known as Dia, and is now <coughs> observed in hundreds of libraries and schools across the country on or near April the 30th. In the words of the founder, Dia provides a wonderful opportunity to promote the power of books and reading to change lives for all children. Dia is a daily commitment to link all children to books, languages, and cultures. Our celebration featured greeting each family, providing a program to adults and a passport to literacy to each child. Each child was encouraged to visit tables from each of the schools and preschools and have their passport stamped. He or she would then present their five stamped passports to the bookmobile and get a free book. Um, we estimated that over 300 books were distributed at last year's celebration. Uh, also, we were able to distribute parenting kits from San Mateo County's First Five uh, Commission in various languages, and throughout the afternoon, uh, families can enjoy multicultural performances and gather on stage for storytelling from the pros. In addition to the literacy and festive focus, the event also warmly introduces young children and families to their neighborhood schools and preschools and to the uh, community resources. At the risk of omitting key contributors, we would like to thank and acknowledge Randy Schwartz, Danielle Brewer, Barbara Brooksfort, and John Alita. Also, we'd like to thank and acknowledge Mr. Alita and Ms. Brooksfort from the library for applying for a grant from the California State Library System, the DIA committee, to support this year's event. And actually, for this year's event, we've already received 500 books, so we're actually getting uh, optimistic and want to go. Uh, we'd like to also extend a general invitation to this year's event on Saturday, May 8th at the Rotary Pavilion between 1 and 4 p.m. Uh, San Bruno is blessed with strong community spirit and joyful family events. So many thanks for letting us introduce this celebration of Dia de los Niños, Dia de los Libros this evening. I'd also like to introduce my uh, partner in crime here. Vice Chair. Uh, yeah, Vice Chair. Uh, <laughs> Jennifer Blanco. Good evening, everyone. It's, um, really, I'm really excited to come to be before you um, tonight in the rest of the community to speak briefly about um, Dia de los Niños, Dia de los Libros, Dia de los Child, Dia de los Books. Um, this will be our second year introducing this program to the community. We're very, very excited to have a celebration in our community. Um, we have a short PowerPoint presentation for you, about two minutes long. Um, we'd like to end our presentation with that. Um, but before I, we go ahead and get that presentation rolling on for you, um, a quick um, rundown on um, the, uh, the California, California State Library System. Um, California actually became an official, D, official DIA state last year in 2009, so it was a great thing that San Bruno came on board in such a great time. So um, with that and with the California State um, becoming an official DIA state, now they have um, a DIA committee which we are able to um, receive grants and our library was able to um, um, submit a grant and we received $350 and they 
um, have hired someone to do a story card uh, theater presentation at 2 o'clock at the park that afternoon. And we also received 200 books from that, um, from, from that grant. So we will get that um, presentation rolling for you in just a second. This concludes our presentation to the City Council and to the community, and we invite City Council to please attend our second annual Day of the Child, Day of the Book, Dia de los Niños, Dia de los Libros celebration on May 8th from 1 to 4 at the Rotary Pavilion, and we extend this invitation to the rest of the community who have attended, who attended last year, and we'd like for them to return, and for those who didn't uh, get the opportunity to attend, for them to attend this year. Thank you very much. Thank you very Thank much. You. We look forward to attending.